guys, welcome back to your wine girl. So today is Crafty Thursday, and every Thursday we do a craft beer review. So if you guys have been watching me, um, I mentioned on a What's New Friday that pumpkin beers were new, and I said I was going to do Punkle. So here I am, delivering with Punkle. Okay, so Punkle is a pumpkin beer, or pumpkin style beer, uh, Dunkle style from Lakewood. Lakewood Brewing is out of Garland, Texas, um, so it's not too far from me. Um, so it's right outside of the Dallas area. Uh, they make a lot of good stuff. We were talking about their uh, Lakewood, the temptress that we had the peanut butter earlier. So we're trying another seasonal of theirs that they, um, they've been doing this for several years now, uh, the Punkle. Now, interesting fact about this. It says it is a pumpkin pie spice dunkle. Now if you read on the side, it tells you that it actually does not have any pumpkin in it. It is based on the pumpkin pie dessert. So instead of actually having pumpkin, it has, as they put it, cinnamon, allspice, nutmeg, and ginger. It's a dark malty German lager, but with a lighter body, so meaning the dunkle part. So it's like a pumpkin pie without the pumpkin. So this is going to be interesting. We're going to try. It's 5.5% and um, this, I got one bottle. It's about $1.99 maybe give or take um, at your grocery store or wherever your wine or beer retailer. Um, and about for a six pack, about 7 to $10 depending. Maybe about the average price is about $9.99. So once again, this is seasonal. So if you guys are starting to see this, take advantage because the pumpkin beers, they can be a hit or miss. You can find them really quick um, and then they could be gone for the rest of the season. So take advantage guys, as with all seasonal beers. So here we go with my little bitty glass. Oh yes, that definitely looks like a dunkel. I love dunkels guys. Um, Dunkles in general, I just really like just because they are like a lighter, um, they are a lager style and they um, they have the nice flavor that you don't get from a regular lager, but almost like with the dark beer, but without being so heavy. So I'm a big fan of Dunkles. Oops, let's talk about the smell first, sorry. cinnamon right on the nose. Yeah, it tastes like pumpkin pie spice. Let's just put it out there. It really does. Cinnamon. Cinnamon really over like that's the prominent thing that you get. Um, do you get a little bit of clove? I'm not exactly sure what allspice tastes like 100% because usually that's mixed in with other uh, spices, but I'm pretty sure there's gonna be some allspice. It really does taste like pumpkin pie spice, guys. It's, it's pretty darn tasty. But yeah, if it had pumpkin in it, there'd probably be a little bit more body. Um, so it actually, yeah, I can see that it does, I don't really get any pumpkin flavor at all, but you'd really get the pumpkin pie spice. It's quite pleasant. Okay. So I agree with this label on that. It really does have all the pumpkin pie spice without the pumpkin. Um, but I really do get that, you know, it is fall. It really makes me appreciate the different beers that are coming out. It gives you into the fall spirit. And I really do enjoy this. Um, so if you guys are looking for a pumpkin beer that's not got a whole bunch of pumpkin influence, obviously, and something that's going to be light, still and refreshing, something that you kind of want to have several of, um, because I, I could have... You know, well, not me, but um, 
you know, this is something that you could easily drink more than one or two. It's only 5.5%, but it's not overpowering. Um, so if you guys are looking for something like that, this is definitely the choice for that. Um, I really could just see myself really enjoying this. So this could definitely go with the pumpkin pie if you want to try it out. Um, any of your fall favorites, like maybe some popcorn would be really good with some, um, like maybe some candied popcorn, uh, caramel popcorn. This would definitely go good with, kind of bring out a little bit more of the flavor. Um, but, oh yeah, I'm really digging this, guys. All right, so thank you so much for joining me on our pumpkin beer. Um, crafty thursday stay tuned guys i'm going to try to do more pumpkin beer reviews as i find them um so they're starting to slowly come out remember that we got the october fest coming like that are out right now and then the slowly we have the pumpkin ones coming out so as they're coming out i'm going to try to review them for you guys before they're out uh before they're out of stock so thank you guys for joining me cheers